All right, guys, this is going to be an updated living room tour. I recently moved into my new apartment, and um, I wanted to show you guys around because I know I like watching living room and home tours, and the last one um, seemed to be enjoyed by a lot of people. So this is what this is going to be, and I'll tell you everywhere I got, or I'll tell you where I got everything from. All right, so we'll start in my little corner nook area. It's right next to uh, my fireplace. And this is where I do all of my writing and work. Um, I got the table from Target for like $50. It's just a regular Parsons desk, kind of remnant of the, um, I want to say who had it, West Elm. You know, when West Elm had that high gloss desk out. That was really, what is that? <laughs> but yeah, so that was $50. Um, this lamp I got from the thrift store is just a vintage brass, brass lamp. Um, and I bought this lampshade a couple of weeks ago from Target. Not Target, God, I'm lying. Ross. Got it from Ross from $9.99. I have two of these lamps. But of course, I only could find one of the lampshades. Sh Go figure so I was like okay well we'll work that out a different way um, these are all with the exception of the flawless picture DIYs I purchased the frames from Big Lots but I printed the prints off of um, Pinterest and if you guys don't follow me on Pinterest you should because I am I will give you life on Pinterest honey um, I got that wall scone from Target and I will link that down below. There is my little blinged out skull that I got from Ross. Some washi tape. <laughs> because I be in the plant, I be I be about that plan in life now. Um, this little diamond trinket came from Five and Below. This like a boss cup came from Diamond Below. These are so cute. I said, oh my gosh. Let me see if I can zoom. It's not going to let me zoom. I'm still trying to work on my camera issues, y'all. But uh, I got these pencils or whatever from uh, the Target dollar spot. I said somebody got the memo. Um, I got this black and white file holder from Target as well. And then I got this calendar. It's a 2015 and 16 calendar from Target from the dollar spot. I think this was like $3. I was like, yeah. So the only thing that I'm waiting on getting now is a chair. Um, I ordered a ghost chair, and it actually is its not the clear acrylic. It's black acrylic, so I'm waiting for that to come in. And as you guys will see, throughout all of my home tours, I am completely obsessed with home decor. I'm not, well, yeah, that too, but uh, <laughs> black and white. All right, so you guys remember this chase? There's my baby. I didn't have another baby, y'all. Remember this chase from my previous home decor it was uh I'm not chase but this sectional and chase it was attached so it was like uh, I'll link that video below anyway I detached it recently because um I just wanted some a change but when I first moved it was still attached like it was prior um but there's the other wall scone so that's how it looks on both sides and so again the, the chase and lounge futon situation came from Walmart still going strong y'all I've had it for what two and a half almost three years now um, I got this uh, faux fur if you want to call it rug or throw from um, Ross a couple of weeks ago right at the same time that I got that lampshade it was $14.99 I was like oh my god it's so comfortable that pillow came from Ross you guys will see a pattern I love Ross um, these tables that I have had for almost two years and have not gotten around to spray painting them yet um, are also from Ross. They were $39.99 each. The lamp is from Ross and the lampshade. Right now it's a stark white. I'm going to um, do a DIY video because I actually am going to add some black into that. I have some Chanel or inspired coasters. Um, that I ordered from AliExpress a few months ago. 
and they actually come like this I just haven't peeled off the paper on this one it's hard as hell to do um, but I love these one they keep people's drinks off my mirrored furniture because as you know mirrored furniture is too damn hard to keep clean um, but they also are super super cute I think they were like six dollars I'll try to find the link for the seller this is my little painting I DIY this I'm going to do a lot more um, DIY videos on my channel because I enjoy them. I have these fur pillows that I got from Ross like last year around Christmas time. I am, j they're just here chilling right now because I haven't found um, any new pillows. But of course I'm going to change those out. There is another lamp and table from Ross. That coffee table I got from Wayfair.com for my birthday. <laughs> I was telling everybody to buy me uh, house stuff for my birthday. Um, this is what I'm reading right now. I actually need to look through these books. There's my girl Taraji. She is from Oxon Hill. Y'all know I'm from Maryland, so yes. This is my candle from Bath and Body Works. And right now, flannel is burning and if you don't know about that then you should um, there is a Chanel book and I got this from where did I get that from TJ Maxx I am obsessed with skulls y'all my mother hates it but I'm like listen there's my little candle situation I got those from Ross as well and I also got that pumpkin from Ross last year there's my fireplace and yes it works it's so pretty. Ooh, I almost fell in here. And then there's my TV. I'm still trying to work out my entire situation with cord hiding and all of that. But yeah. So short and sweet, guys. That was my living room tour. I used to have a rug up underneath there. It had the whole quarter fill pattern. It was white and black. I just lifted it up because I actually just shampooed my carpets. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. There will be more DIYs and more home tours to come as I get settled in my new place. And I'll talk to you in another video. Bye!